The tasks on this Choosing Wisely list, um, which have been recommended not be done in low-risk people, are important to think about from two perspectives. One is they're expensive. Even if they're low-cost tests, if they're done on lots of people, they generate high medical costs, and medical care is just getting too expensive in this country, particularly if there's no certain benefit. But maybe the more important reason is to avoid doing harm to patients. Let me give two examples. One of the recommendations says that if uh, a low-risk person, that is a person who doesn't have risk factors for intestinal cancer, has a negative screening colonoscopy, that they don't need any more screening for 10 years or so. It's been pretty routine to ask those patients to come back and do a stool blood test sample every year, even when the colonoscopy was negative. The problem is, if the stool blood test sample is positive, it could well be falsely positive and lead the clinician on a merry chase with additional tests with risks like doing another colonoscopy and perhaps perforating the colon, which could uh, create the need for a big surgical repair. So even though that little stool blood test isn't expensive or a big deal in itself, it can lead to big problems down the line. And if it doesn't need to be done, best not to do it. Another example is several of the societies recommended uh, not doing routine electrocardiograms or stress tests in people at low risk of heart disease. Well, a cardiogram isn't that expensive. Why not just do it? Well, in fact, if the cardiogram looks a little funny, that might tempt the clinician to take another step, maybe a stress test. If that looks a little funny, then the clinician might uh, suggest a coronary angiogram, an invasive test, where a catheter actually has to be put in an artery and threaded up into the heart to see if there are any blockages there. That test can cause important complications like a stroke, all from that cardiogram that probably didn't need to be done in the first place.